Now, Carl Frampton is making his final preparations for his world title showdown with Kiko Martinez on Saturday at Belfast Titanic Quarter. And our sports reporter uh, Ruth Gorman has been with the Frampton camp in the build-up to the knockout bite. Fight week has finally arrived. Team Jackal flew into Belfast a few days ago after 14 weeks in London. And behind the scenes, the Titanic quarter is shaping up nicely for one of the biggest boxing events to hit Belfast. Over the weekend, Frampton met the press in Dublin and caught up with his family. He says it's been tougher than ever being away from his wife and young daughter this time around. Christine's at home and um, she, she's pregnant at the minute. Um, she's got our other daughter, Carla, to be looking after as well. So, you know, I would like to be home, um, helping her as much as I can, but... We both understand that you know, what I'm doing here is going to benefit the both of us in the long run. What Frampton's manager Barry McGuigan has done for boxing here, no one will forget. He's invested much time into turning Frampton into the next big thing. You know, all I can do is pass on uh, the little bits of advice, but it's not something I can do in five minutes. You know, we've spent uh, four and a half years with Carl, uh, slowly, uh, trying to change him and alter him in, in, in many different ways. But he's a bright kid, fundamentally bright and hugely talented. Winning a world title is not just Frampton's dream. His trainer, Shane McGuigan, has been with him every step of the way. Oh, it's a massive dream of mine. You know, my dad's obviously my... You know, everyone grows up with their father as a rider, and, and I've watched all his DVDs, and, and everyone always says, oh, what was, you know... How come you, you, know, you never got a chance to see it? You know, how, how much has that, has that affected you? But now I'm reliving it with Carl, and um, it's, it's, it's fantastic. And you know, I think Dad didn't fulfill his true potential. There's obviously a couple of things that went on in his career, and we're going to make sure that Carl doesn't go through those situations and he can completely maximise his potential. I see him coming head first and pretty much trying to knock me out. That's, that's going to be his game plan, um, but it's up to me to remain smart and remain switched on for three minutes of the 12 rounds and if that's the case I win this fight you know if I as long as I do as I'm told and stay focused there's only going to be one winner. Frampton and Martinez will be on show in Victoria Square for a public workout this Wednesday before meeting the press on Thursday and weighing in at the Ulster Hall on Friday. Ruth Gorman UTV Live.